I'm Storm Team Meteorologist Alexis Walters. You won't need the umbrellas as you're out the door this morning, but have the rain gear handy because by the afternoon I am tracking rain. This morning it is cooler to start with temperatures in the low and mid 60s. By your lunch hour, still dry, I expect, aside from maybe an isolated shower, temperatures at that point inching towards 80. It's about the time you're heading home from work that I expect scattered showers and some rumbles of thunder to start to pop up. This will all be passing over, but keeping with us through the evening and overnight hours. So you could could still hear those rumbles of thunder as you're heading to bed tonight. Even waking up tomorrow morning, we could still see some spotty showers. Temperatures again tomorrow in the low and mid 60s by the afternoon, only reaching the upper 70s. Now, once the cold front passes over with that last batch of rain and storms through the afternoon and evening, we're going to start to pick up on some cooler air for your Wednesday. Highs are only going to be in the mid 70s at best. We'll kick off the morning in the upper 50s. So hour by hour, your Monday, we will inch our way through the 70s. Is not a quick warm up, but we do have an isolated shower chance around your lunch hour. But the best chance to see rain and storms will be about that evening rush hour. The next seven days cool through the middle of the work week, but then we start to heat back up by Friday. Temperatures quickly moving to the low 80s on Friday, mid and upper 80s for your weekend. After tomorrow's rain and storm chances, it is smooth sailing, lots of sunshine, several pool days on hand as we close out the week.